the first picture of Earth is taken from space, the precursor to the internet is established, and HDTV is launched in the US. It all happened this week in tech history. This week in 1861, the first transcontinental telegraph line across the United States was completed, spelling the end for the 18-month-old Pony Express, which ceased operations just two days later. The remaining assets of the Pony Express were sold to Wells Fargo for $1.5 million. In 1946 this week, a camera on board a V-2 rocket, which was launched from the White Sands Missile Range in New Mexico, took the first photograph of Earth from outer space. The German V-2 rocket had been captured by the Americans at the end of World War II. The explosive warhead was removed and replaced with a package of scientific instruments. These included a 35mm motion picture camera set to snap one picture every second and a half. This week in 1955, the microwave oven was introduced in Mansfield, Ohio at the corporate headquarters of the Tappan Company. The new cooking device had a price tag of about $1,300, which would translate to over $11,000 today. No wonder they only manufactured 34 units in that first year. The invention of the microwave oven, incidentally, was an accident. In the 1940s, Percy Spencer was building magnetrons for use in radar sets. He had a chocolate bar in his pocket when he came too close to a running magnetron tube, and the candy began to melt. In 1969 this week, the first ever computer-to-computer -computer link was established on ARPANET, which was the precursor to what we know now as the internet. The transmitted message was intended to be the word login. The letters L and O were transmitted, but the letter G crashed the system. And this week in 1998, HDTV broadcasting in the US was inaugurated with the launch of the STS-95 space shuttle mission, which blasted off with 77-year-old astronaut John Glenn on board, making him the oldest person to go into space. That's our look back at This Week in Tech History, brought to you by IFA in Berlin. IFA, the Global Innovations Show. Meet the official partner of the future in Berlin. Hey everyone, Cameron Graveline here. Remember, call in, win stuff. Thank you. Be sure to stop by our site anytime at intotomorrow.com, check out our many posts, and subscribe to our free podcasts. We'll catch you next time on This Week in Tech History.